That's Kenneth. And he's done well so far. Derek Wyrden pulls his shot wide of target in the 90th minute at East Road. The cross from Stephen Glass. Gary Caldwell's there. In went Gary O'Connor. And Gary Smith has surely now won the game for Hibbs with his first goal of the season. You won't find a much more unlikely match winner and 10 man Hibbs look to have secured all three points Dundee United are deflated they couldn't get it clear from the glass cross and it was Gary Smith who had the final say it's 3-2 taking on Calvinus and brushing him aside Nobody just passed it on the edge of the area. Brown now for Shields. They're toying with Dundee United. It's Ivan Scrowl, and it is 3 0. And it has been a highly effective second half performance from Hibbs. Scrowl gets in on the out. Well, it's been a much improved performance. Second half from Hibbs, as I said. Three goals. But to be quite honest, from a Dundee United point of view, this is embarrassing. He started on the right, nobody made a challenge. Ball finds its way to Sproul. Look at the space he's got. Nobody wants to take responsibility. Nobody wants to pick him up. Derek Stilley's left with no chance at all. It's a great finish from Sproul, but to be quite honest with you, Ian, the time and the space afforded to him was an embarrassment. The finish was excellent. Hibs have thoroughly deserved. Ryan again, finding Whittaker. Shields going forward again with a real purpose. That's good play by Dean Shields. Didn't quite catch the shot properly. You can see the frustration there, but look at this direct positive running, good footwork, stepping onto his left foot there for the shot. Umama forward for Dean Shields. Shields under a bit of pressure and he's done so well. Into the middle, a chance perhaps now. Fletcher! Stephen Fletcher pulls one back for Hibbs, brings him back into this game. And the ball came into the penalty area and a flick from Fletcher sat up nicely for him. They volleyed it past the goalkeeper. A fine goal by Stephen Fletcher. Makes it 3-2. Shields. Murray. Borat has committed himself. It didn't reach Antoine Courier though. Shields with a flick on. All and raise it again. It's going to go wide this time. But uh, he looks so, so lightly grey. He's hurt after colliding with Langfield. He looks like a real goal scorer. He's just waiting for mistakes and for flick-ons. This time it's Shields that gets the ball and Langfield does really well. That's a decent ball going inside there. Just pass. Shields coming up on the outside. And you know... It uh, really is a ball that should have been picked up by Rickson. Shields attempted the layoff there. Stuart made that tackle strongly. On Britain. That's Whittaker. Shields again. Into Killen. Great play again. Wonderful play from Hibbs. Chris Killen gets his 11th goal of the season. Once more, it's terrific attacking play from him early and Dean Shields at the heart of it all, taking that pass at pace. Shields stood up to that, measured the pass, and Killen with a top out beat Tony Bullock. And 
fine play once again from the Bernie and the build up was good Murphy a lovely touch from Shields that was quality and here's Scott Brown yeah, they've got some good young players and when they want to turn it on Hibs they can, they've got ability great flick from Shields Scott Brown finds himself driving into the box the finish is not quite there so it was a very interesting Hibernian formation at the start of the match We're playing a 4-2-3-1 formation Here's Dean Shields, who's one of the three, the central of the three. And a very fine attempt by Shields. Well, a good score he regularly has this season, despite not playing every match. And look at the way he takes this inside, looking for his seventh goal of the season, and that's just past the junction. Thompson to Benjamin, good first touch once more. Delightful pass, that's Shields! Blocked there by Langfield, but some terrific play again from Benjaloon who really has been outstanding in the opening 10 minutes just look at the way that played that ball through the gap there for Shields coming in the angle was tight it still needed a good save from Langfield this is his first corner remarkably they need one back Shields takes it and Killen has got one back Chris Killen claiming it and John Collins' side have scored in a cracking Edinburgh derby. Well, I just said it. They'll take it back in this game. They certainly have now. It's an absolutely terrific header. It really is. It's a good ball in. There's plenty of bodies in there. Nobody picks Killing up. And it's a powerful header. Straight into the corner. Craig Gordon, no chance. Hips back in this game. And freedom. Felbert McGeady dived. Shields. Oh, he nearly squeezed that in the bottom corner. Dean Shields. Well, that was lovely play. He makes the chance himself. It does break to him. It's a lovely little step over. He hits it early and almost catches Boric out. So he drags it inside. Hits it with his left foot. Brown managed to thread that through to David Murphy Shields up ahead Dave Mackay is at his back so is Richard Britton he's still got it in it was a great ball in from Shields and Livingston survive with Dorado knocking that over his own crossbody he had to get that absolutely right Otherwise, he could have put the ball in the back of his own net for 1-0. Here's Ladin. Forward out of Shields. Good position this for Hibbs. Very impressive first half from Young Shields. Always looking to get his turn in, get his shot off, or play a positive ball forward. Up there's Ladin. It's a good pass. Shields. On the right hand side is Whitty. Better play from Hibbs. It's O'Connor trying to set up for Shields. Well, uh, Boric has that effect of making things look so easy. Better play. Better play from Hibbs. Uh, kicking players out. Bouncing the ball off O'Connor there. Shot for a great take. Good shot.